Hi everyone. I'm here today to talk to you about body trust, what it means, how to do it, you know, how do you get to that point in your life where you know that you can trust yourself and above all else, learn how to tune anything else out so you can fully be present and know what that's like, that freeing feeling when you're just like, you know what, I trust myself and it feels great and I don't care what you say, I'm gonna do it for me. So let's start. Body trust for me means that you listen to that inner voice. You listen to that gut feeling and you honor it and you do it just unapologetically. Like, this is what I need. I'm doing it. I don't care what anyone else says. I don't care what diet culture says. I don't care what my friends say, my family, whoever else. I am doing this because I know this is what I need right now. That is body trust. It's just knowing that you're the expert of you above anything else it's hard to get there. Let me tell you, like just undoing those years and years and years of learning what everyone else is telling you what to do, years of dieting, listening to diet culture, the media, everything. It's like, it takes time, but give yourself practice and patience and you can get there. So here are some of my tips. First, it's just being curious and listen. When you get that eat, like urge to maybe eat again. Say you just ate like an hour ago and you're hungry again and getting that urge. But if you hear things that's telling you to like not eat and to question it and to tell you like, oh, you shouldn't, and start the inner, that inner voice, look at it with curiosity. Where did this come from? Is this true? Should I not trust my body right now? Is it, is it bad that I'm eating? Should I not eat? Why can't I? Question that voice. Question why you're feeling that way and just know that you're, it's okay to be hungry again and honor that. Just look at it from curiosity, question it, and just do it anyway. Because that's the only way you're going to rebuild that trust that your body knows what's best for you. None of this, oh, what I'm emotional eating, I'm bored, I'm eating, I'm doing all the things. Like, no, just allow yourself that permission to eat. That is what is truly freeing and flexible about the body trust. If you're questioning like, oh, I really want to rest today. I don't want to exercise and where my body at. I'm really stressed. I just, it's just one more thing to do. That is fine. If you're saying what I should, or, oh, I can't, or just do it anyway. Just rest. Allow yourself that permission to rest. You don't have to do all the things just because someone else is doing it or just because you think it's expected of you or just because diet culture tells you you have to exercise every day or whatever it is. You are allowed to listen to your body and give it rest because it needs it. Those are some examples. If you have any other examples or things that you're curious about, let me know in the comments and ask me. I would love to just walk it through with you and, and show you that. Every time that you have that like inner voice that says like, yeah, I should do this, but then there's something else behind it going, mm, I, I can't or I shouldn't, question that voice. Question that other voice that tells you that you can't. Because let me tell you, that inner voice, that gut feeling is something you can trust. Not the can't, not the shouldn't voice, the other voice, the diet culture voice, the other one that tells you no. That is my tip. Um, I hope this helps. And again, let me know if you have any questions.